scientists have used an experimental drug to cure 18 monkeys infected with the deadly Ebola virus. This sets the stage for the first human trials of the drug. If all goes well, it could lead to the first effective weapon against deadly Ebola. They are very encouraging, these results. They are the first evidence in um, an animal model that is, well, fairly close to, to us as human primates. Um, that we may be on the way to an effective treatment. There are currently no approved treatments or vaccines against the disease, and more than 1,500 people have died from the disease. Well, surprisingly to me, the epidemic is still expanding. Um, 40 percent of all uh, cases of Ebola infection in West Africa um, since December, basically, of last year, have occurred in the last three weeks which means that there is actually an expansion of the epidemic that's very worrisome, perhaps also because major cities such as Monrovia are now affected and uh, so it will get probably uh, worse before it's getting better. In the latest study, researchers described how they came up with a powerful cocktail of drugs called ZMAP. The drug is manufactured using tobacco plants that have been manipulated to mass produce antibodies that go into ZMAP. The researchers gave the drug to 18 monkeys infected with Ebola, some just days or hours from death. All 18 animals survived. By contrast, three monkeys that did not receive the drug died by day eight. Though seven people infected with Ebola have received ZMAP so far, it's not clear whether the drug works in people too. It could take two more years to assess if it's safe, and then another year or two for it to be approved for widespread use. Until then, doctors will have to try and save infected people in other ways, by maintaining their fluids, oxygen and blood pressure, and by treating them for any complicating infections.